Hey guys, welcome back to another video today. It is I Mario 100, and welcome back to another episode of Leco. Today I have a game for a console that has an opening whenever you turn it on. Uh, let's just. I'm playing on the GameCube today. Uh, so yeah, this is my GameCube. I've already done a series on it with, uh, Sonic 3, but today we got a different game. I'm sorry if the camera can't hear it, but because I can't find my remote to turn on the camera. I mean, turn on the volume on the TV. But yeah, that, we're playing Kirby Air Ride. I will ha be having three ser uh, three videos for this. So for the next three Saturdays, I'll be doing Kirby Air Ride, Kirby Top Ride, and Kirby City Trial. This video is Kirby Air Ride. We're gonna be showing off the main point of the game. The other ones are just other parts. So we have uh, we have like nine stages and then we got random. You get eight stages, you have to unlock Nebula Belt, which we might go on to. But yeah, uh, you start you also start off with I think only the warp star, but you unlock some more as you do challenges. I'll go on to those in a bit. So yeah, we're gonna start off with the main Warp Star. And to play the game, you literally only need one hand. You use the stick, and then you can use one button, which could be either trigger, that's why I'm saying you can use one hand, or you can press A, which I prefer A. A is to uh, do that to break. Uh, drift, suck it in ability, sometimes use an ability, and then you got your stick to steer. If you're going up a ramp or going up, if you press hold down, you can kind of fly. And that's pretty much the basis of the game. That's that's it. It's really fun. I don't see why more people don't play it. it why there isn't more people who play it. Um. But yeah, there's, there's that. There's enemies that come. You can get different abilities. Like, uh, like so some of them are just, you suck up and you spit out. And you can hit in, in your uh, opponents. I'm sorry, I got only third because I was trying to show off stuff. But yeah, there's also abilities that we haven't, we didn't really get to show off. Uh, let's, yeah, there's pretty much the warp star. That's just the basic card. Let's go on to this one with uh, the Wing Star. The Wing Star is pretty much like the uh, normal Warp Star. It's a bit different, like, but the only thing I that is really known for, it's incredibly faster when flying. So yeah, that's cool. We're gonna get our first ability, Wing. I'm not really sure what it does besides making you go faster and you're not really in your car anymore. You can't charge, which is a thing that happens when you brake. So like, when you're like turning, you can hold the brake and it will do a charge. It's really good because it gives you a boost when you let go. And uh, our next ability, sword. Sword slashes enemies or just anything that gets in my way hopefully I can show it off but probably not there you go oh never mind next ability plasma it's not spark it's plasma plasma is different because by uh, you use plasma by moving around so you gotta shake your stick a lot and then boom A 
cool little uh, thing to uh, know about this game is the music is really good. Just to, I'm just gonna say that the music's really good. But also, some of the music in this game was used for the anime Hoshi no Kabi or uh, Kirby Right Back at You in America. Well, the thing is, it was used, except it wasn't used in a, in the English dub for some reason. I have no idea why that is, though. It's really dumb. Because the music's really good. Uh, but yeah, th this game is really associated with that anime, because, like, it came out around the same time. So like the uh, the commercial for the game had like footage from the show, footage footage from, uh, stuff from the show, and just a ton of stuff like that. Next we have the Rocket Star. The Rocket Star. It pretty much goes with the whole charge thing I was talking about. With the charge, you can charge up a lot. And then it does a big boost. So just boom. I wouldn't say it's really that good for racing, considering you have to like just sit there a lot. Here's a little shortcut. If you go through the sand. I remember I used to be obsessed with this game. At one point, pretty much when I got it, I stopped playing it, but I'm glad to uh, play it again. The boost doesn't really seem any good if you're just using it, but if you like charge it up all the way, it's pretty good. This is Needle. Needle uh, just makes a big hitbox whenever you press it. It's really good for uh, one of the other modes that We'll probably be uh, doing in one of the other videos. So yeah, that's that. Um, ooh, I hope I can get to that. Probably not because it's so slow. Gosh, I just want to get to this enemy. Gosh, come on, we're chasing after him. If you didn't know, this enemy that we're cha chasing after is called Wheelie, which is literally just a car. That we did a little shortcut. Hopefully, we can. There we go. Now we have the wheel ability. We're just a wheel. There we are. <laughs> It's way faster than the charger, or charger, nice. Uh, I can't even think. What is it? <laughs> really quickly, we have uh, fire. Whenever you press, it shoots a little thing, and it, uh, it leaves fire. Um, I'm just going to go ahead and do Nebula Belt, and... I'm just gonna show it off now. Meta Knight, which works like uh, pretty much the wing ability and the sword ability at the same time. So we're going with the uh, uh, wing, and if we go into an opponent, it uses the sword. We cannot get abilities or anything like that. But he does fly pretty good, pretty well. Um, I'm pretty sure you can, again, with the music, I'm pretty sure you can't hear it. But this song that is playing for Nebula Belt, I have played on the channel before. It is the same song that plays during the, like, baseball minigame in uh, Kirby Star Allies. That's, uh... Pretty cool thing, I'm glad they brought the music into that. 
because it's really good. As I've said a million times, it should be known. It, it should be known. We can see that there's another Mennonite and someone using wheel. We're not doing really good. Yeah, this track, it is... A, you have to unlock it. And all it is is just a straight track and then a bit of a turn and then a straight track and <laughs> that's pretty much it besides this part up here where it's just like a sharp turn and then another one yeah but with the game that you can literally just do with one hand There's a bit of skill of it, into it with like mastering the carts and learning how to work with all the stages and stuff. He just threw a bomb. That ability uh, makes a huge explosion. And there you go, that's it. There's only two laps. And oh, I'm not sure you could have heard that sound, but. The sound that just played means I got a challenge done, which the challenge, the challenges let you earn the stuff that I was talking about, like the stage or stuff like that. There's also a free run, which allows you to do, just do the races, time trial or whatever, the records, as I said. The uh, They incorporated this into pretty much the uh, challenges in Smash 3DS, I think? Yeah, there's, there's a lot. But, yeah, that's about it for this, uh, video. I, they, there's still more I have to show, but I think I can show them off in the other modes. That's about it for this video. Uh, see you all next time. And, uh, bye.